Hello everybody, I'm Matt. I'm Chase. And we are? Punxaris. Alright, what we're going to do today is we're going to do like a walkthrough video of partial, of my collection partially. We're not going to do the whole thing because it's quite a bit. In the other room i got to get some stuff organized and stuff as well because I'm waiting for some protectors before I put the rest of the stuff up. So I'm just going to do like the living room for now and then I'll do the rest of it. Potentially, probably will be Friday honestly because I have pop protectors coming. I'll get everything protected up and then do the video then. So what we're going to start with first is we'll probably start with uh, my Venomize, some of my Venomize set, work our way around Game of Thrones, and I'll probably show off, uh, I have some non-Funko related stuff. Some of it is, some of it isn't, statues and stuff as well. But we're going to start with Venomize first, so I'm going to flip the camera around and we'll get started. Okay, what we have going on up here is the entire first wave of the Venomize Funkos. Uh, I love the line. I first said I wasn't going to get the line specifically because of, where are they at, let me see, uh, that one and that one, because they was very expensive. So I was going to just say screw it and not get it, but then I decided to just go ahead and roll with it. I got a good price. I actually caught the jumping one on uh, Amazon, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. I actually got the whole box and then the other one I think I got, I only ended up paying like 30 for that and a couple other pops because somebody was selling it on Macari. So I got those. Uh, now we're gonna move over here to some Game of Thrones. Okay, this is some of the Game of Thrones collection. It's kinda high, I'm trying to get up as high as I can. I need to get a tripod or a selfie type stick. I'm in progress of getting that now. Uh, I got those over here, and then we're gonna work our way over to some more Game of Thrones. We have uh, sorry the noise, I actually have a package getting delivered today. It's some fuckos, ironically enough. But, uh, I got, let me see, I'll try to get in depth here a little bit. I should have done it with the other ones, actually. We got Tormund, Yara, Original Ned, I wish it was headless. Green of Tarth, uh, Beric, Melisandre, the Sitting Brand, Arya from the ECCC, I believe is what it is. I think it's the ECC, maybe. It's one of the spring conventions. It's a spring conviction, sorry. The other Arya, a few of the Jon Snows, Khal Drago, Elena Tyrell, she's probably my favorite character, or was my favorite character. Daenerys, Dragon, Namira, Ghost, Liam Mormont. And then we got the Battle of the Bastards, uh, Tyrion with the Cup, the other Tyrion, another one. Daenerys on the Dragonstone, Lord Varys, the Gendry, Cersei, the one with the crown, the Armored Mountain, and the regular mountain. And we move on to the White Walker, the Night King, the at t Night King, uh, Children of the Forest, and then Davos. Funny story about him, uh, I actually ordered him, he got restocked on at t .com. And I caught it, and I bought it, and then it went down, and then I got a message from AT&T that said uh, and my order was canceled. So I checked my uh, tracking, and it said that it was canceled. So I was like, oh, bummer, whatever. And then it showed up. So here it is, and I'm going to go back up here and hit these real quick, too. So I forgot to do that. The Mounted White Walker, we got Giant White, 1-1, one, one, Tyrion on a the throne. There's the big boys, the three-pack metallic dragons. I'm really short, sorry. Uh... Night King on Ice of Assyrian. We got the Night King on the throne. Daenerys on the throne. Cersei on the throne. Jon Snow on the throne. We got Owen on the floor. <laughs> then I'm going to go ahead and get these real quick. This is my little Joker shelf I have going on here. Uh, it's That's like a bobblehead. I got these little figures on actually Wish. The bank robber type ones or whatever. Uh, I ordered them off Wish for like five bucks or something. Loved them. These are a Comic-Con exclusive, this Harley and this Joker. I caught those on Macari. Sorry about the lighting, I'm trying. I got the window open for some help. Then we got the Bank Robber Bobblehead. He's pretty cool, he's Funko brand. A little wooden one. Uh, this one, funny story, out of box pop, I don't do. This is the, what is this one from? Killing, Death of the Family, yeah. I ordered this and then this guy over here opened it for me and when he opened it, he sliced the box. So we have an out-of-box pop. And then, of course, BB and me, I had to order another one because I'm particular. So I have another one in the other room with the rest of my Joker collection. 
we have just a couple little, one little mystery mini thing, and then just, this was like a little tiki thing. I think it was from a loot crate box or something. This is actually really neat. I'm going to flip it. It's, a, it's like a porcelain type statue. It's Joker. It's not Funko or nothing, but I thought it was really neat. The detail on him is just freaking fantastic. I'll probably be posting some pictures of some of this stuff when I do my Joker collection on uh, Instagram. So follow me on Instagram. It's just Funks R Us. No underscore, no nothing. Just Funks R Us. One word. Okay, back this way, we got a little Joker cup. I think I got this at Spencer's, I believe, actually. And then we're going to work our way down here. I'm going to flip it because these are tall. We got a little Harley. This is a 25 year, I believe. Uh, I don't know what it is. It's a 25th anniversary of something, but she's actually sitting on Batman and it says, Happy anniversary, Harley. Love, Mr. J. She's got a little gun sitting on him. It's pretty well. It's kind of articulate. It's not real great, but I love it. I think it's great. This one I actually posted on Instagram. This is the Batman Who Laughs statue thing. Diamond Gallery. The detail on him is just freaking beautiful. His face, his card, the chain. It kind of looks tarnished. His cape and everything. Uh, we got some Flash because I like the Flash. So I got that one. We're going to work our way down here. We have a Venom one that's pretty cool. I'll probably post some pictures of this eventually as well. But this was another, I believe it's a Diamond Gallery as well. Uh, it's pretty cool. But you can just see the symbiote coming off of his face and off of his skin. It's cool. Then we got a little Drax and Groot. Nothing too special about that one. I saw it was a great deal. I had to get it. But it really does look like Batista. Like <laughs> They did an excellent job. This next one is probably the rarest one, the most expensive one I have. It's actually an old school gambit. It's, uh, it's he's sitting on the sentinel, standing on the sentinel hand. He's got his uh, staff, but it's actually porcelain. And the bottom of it, I'm not going to pick it up because if I drop it, I will hate myself. And uh, it's hand numbered. The box I had, I think it was 1999 trademark, wasn't it? Yeah. And uh, it was like a yellowy tarnish. It still had like the yellow foam in it. It's super old, but I got a really good deal on him. There's no nicks, no cracks, no nothing. The sentinel hand is really heavy, like it's super heavy. The fingers are like sliced off there if you look, but it's it's super neat. Work our way down, we got the Deadpool statue. This is just the one I believe they sold at GameStop, but I love it, I love how he doesn't have his mask on. I'm a big Destiny guy. Uh, this is Kate 6 if you don't know what that is. He's from Destiny. This right here is actually a Destiny ghost. It's a tattoo I got a while ago, but it's pretty cool too. It was just like a little collector's thing they did. Move on to Hulk. Yeah, you gotta have a Hulk. I mean, I love Hulk. He's one of my favorites. So I got him. Then we got a little Gandalf bobblehead. Cup from Game of Thrones. Some, like, movie things. I'm not sure what they're... What are they called? I don't remember. They're like little movie moment things, kind of. It's Ash, and then we got a Westworld one. And she's got the gun in her hand, if you haven't seen it. And then down here, you can see her coming up out of the basement and stuff. We got a little Dorbs. I've had this one for ever like a long time Dorbs Deadpool and then Los Polos from Breaking Bad Cup all right we're gonna move right along here I think I got all those I'm gonna flip the camera again oh yeah I got this little uh it's actually like a comic book front but it's on a wood uh plaque type thing it's pretty cool then we got the new wave uh the Venomized Pop sorry about the glare everything's in protectors we got all those Daredevil uh, X-23, Rocket, Thanos, Groot, and Storm. Storm's really cool. She's probably one of the coolest ones. Groot's alright too. He's weird looking, kinda. Uh, Thanos I think they could've did more with, but, you know, whatever. Who am I? Okay, we're gonna move along here. We got some of my my Grailies here. The glare is gonna be awful on these because of the hard stacks. They're all in hard stacks. We got Bank Robber. We got Tate. We got Heisenberg, we got the Hound, and this is a Funko related, it's actually Hot Topic, I think it's a Hot Topic exclusive, isn't it? It's the, the uh, gauntlet, just in like a little case, I still have the box, but I did take it out because I thought it looked cool. Got a little Destiny Ghost, uh, I just liked it, so I rolled with it, I'm going to get down here. Alright, we got Bill and Ted, if you've never seen Bill and Ted, excellent adventure, you should really watch it because it's amazing. Great movie. They're older pops. I got a really good deal on them. So I had to scoop those up. We got Carl and Ellie from Up. And that is just the most, one of the cutest, most beautiful pops ever. Happy, sad. You know, you get all them emotions. 
We got some Pokemon. I got the four ones for now. We got Pikachu, Bulbasaur, Charmander, Squirtle. Down to the ET set. I actually got these. I went on like a little pop hunt. And I found these two, ironically enough, at one place. And then they told me about another place that had some pops. And I went right up the road and there was ET. So I got the whole set. I got a pretty good deal on them. I think I paid like 60 or 65 for the whole set. Not bad. Leonard and the Green Lantern. I got the whole set here. Raj, Sheldon, Howard, Penny. Then we got some Breaking Bad ones. We got Walter in his underwear. Then Walter in his hazmat suit. Jess, Jesse in his suit. And then Heisenberg. Moving down here, we got Ultraman. The Glow in the Dark, the Toy Tokyo one. I got rid of some of those, but I really like this one, the glow on it. I got the whole set basically for that. Uh, Guy Fox from V for Vendetta. Uh, cool one. Jerry Garcia. This is a Grateful Dead thing. You guys, a lot of you might not know what that is, but uh, I grew up, my mom was a big, as they called, Deadhead. She was into the Grateful Dead, so and I was just by default, kind of. Saw this, it made me think of her, so I had to get it. Uh, we got the Oompa Loompa. It's the only one I got from the set. I just saw this at this little trading thing I was at and grabbed it because it's an Oompa Loompa. I wish they had had Willy Wonka too, but I got a really good deal. I got a whole bundle deal on him and Liam Mormont and some other ones. Uh, this is some of the office. This is not all I have, but like I said, I'm out of pop protectors at the moment. So I don't put anything in here until I get them in protectors because I have all my pops and protectors. Kevin, Jim, and we got Facebook Jim. Uh, Jim is Dwight. Then we got the three hole punch. Sorry, I'm trying to get some better lighting here. This is kind of in a bad spot. I Room is an issue. I have over 500 at this point. Three hole punch. We got Daryl. Lighting's bad. I apologize. Pam Beasley. We got Dwight. We got Prison Mike. And then we got Michael Scott, the regular one. And then going down, we have Toby versus Michael. This was a Funko Shop exclusive. I liked it a lot. It's a Garfield. He's got the... Uh, you can't really see it. Yeah, see if you can... I don't know if you can see it there or not. But he, yeah, there it is. I hate Monday's cup, so that's cool. Then we got the Madame Leota. Leota, whatever it is. I really can't pronounce it. It's the Disney exclusive. Somebody actually picked this up and gave me a good deal on it. So I grabbed it. We got Ron with the braids from Parks and Rec. I love it. I watched Office and then was uh, recommended Parks and Rec and jumped in it and I loved it just as much. Then I got the other one and then the infamous King and Kodos. Uh, gotta love that. Love it. Probably in my top five favorite, top ten favorite pops I own just because it's freaking, I mean, the design on it is just so different. It was just such a different mold. The glow on it's beautiful. I'm actually working on the rest of the Treehouse of Horrors now. Uh, we got a big Haggard. I got a really good deal. They had three for 17, I think, at Books a Million. <laughs> or not Books a Million. Barnes and Noble. And they included him. He was under the 15, so I was like, okay. Uh, we got the Fox, the flocked one from this year's SDCC. This is a shared one, but whatever. This is one I'd been hunting for a while. I am not the biggest Harry Potter fan, but this pop is freaking amazing. It's the Lucius, Lucius Malfoy, I think is how you pronounce it. Yeah. Uh, he's got the Death Eater mask on. I love it. Never thought I'd get it. And when I went and got the E.T. ones, I actually saw him in a store. Picked him up as well. And this is another cool one, too. The three-pack of Jenny, Fred, and George. The St. Patrick's Day one. I think this is when they're at the, like, the tournament, isn't it? Or something like, yeah, the big game. And it has all them. They're pretty cool, though. They have the... Sorry about the light. They have their faces all painted and stuff. And Jenny's got the hat. It's neat. I like it. It was one I didn't think I'd ever get because the price went up on it so, so much. All right, I'm climbing up now because got to get high. All right, we'll start at the top. We got a lay down Deadpool. He's probably been my most difficult pop, believe it or not, because he's just such weird. His box sideways, it just kind of makes things difficult. But uh, so he ended up up here. Uh, we got the Crystal Ship. I showed this off in a previous video. Check that out if you want to see that one a little bit more in depth. It's Breaking Bad. I love it. We got Kiss the Girl from Little Mermaid. We got Woody on RC. I like how it's like the plain looking. It's an older looking pop, even though it's not. The face has that weird look. RC's cool though. Then we got Buzz with the Pizza Planet truck. And then the Buzz, you can kind of see he's in there. Can't really see him from this angle, but. Then we got the red one. 
Lilo and Stitch, awesome pop. He's becoming kind of hard to find. Stitch is a really hard or big character. People like the Stitch ones a lot. So he goes fast and he goes very expensive. This is a Corella DeVille in the car. For some reason, this pop did not do well. Um, I think it's done well. I love it. I think it was great. Uh, they dropped them to like 15 bucks. Was it a, in a box or was it just a pop? Just a pop. They just dropped it for 15 bucks like really fast for some reason. And I don't know. I loved it. I thought it was done really well. Uh, we'll work our way up. This is the Thanos on the Sanctuary. This is probably one of the bigger pops I had. It's like a regular-ish pop. He's a weird shape. He's huge. He's a collector's corpse, but he's in the ship. Pretty cool. Work our way down to Jaws, the Great White. I wish I would have got the one with the tank, but I didn't. I didn't realize which one I was getting, honestly. I ordered it off Hot Topic. I had some coupons and stuff, and I just can't see myself getting the other one. I just, I'm not a huge Jaw fan. I like it, but not enough to get another pop. And we got Spongebob on the house. I mean, Spongebob, can't really go wrong. Cool pop, neat setup. The house looks really cool. You got Gary on his head there. Then the pineapple. Then we got Pennywise in the gutter. This is one that's becoming a lot harder to find. Really minty. Really cool pop. He's a big Pennywise fan, so, you know, he's got this one as well. It's a really neat one. Uh, Crimes at Grenwald. This was another one. It was on sale for like 10 bucks or 15 bucks. I just picked it up literally because it was that. Movie was good. I enjoyed it. Uh, Johnny Depp, you know, it's good, so. Then we got the Spirit Halloween Sanderson Sisters. I just did a video where I showed that off a little bit. I'll give you a little look here. If you want to check it out, though, check out that last video. I think it was the last one or the one before. And then we got Thor versus Thanos, you know. Should have gone for the head that moment. That has two meanings in the new movie and the old one, so there it is. Deadpool versus Cable. There's another. These are all movie moments and rides. Except for Thanos, he's just weird. Uh, then we got a Magic Carpet Ride, Aladdin, I love Aladdin. It's a cool pop. This is one of my favorites, too. I love this. This is from the Lion King box they did. It has uh, Jafar as the snake. He's wrapped up. This pop is probably one of the heaviest pops I own. Easily. It's crazy. We'll work our way up. We got the Lost Boys set. We got Vampire David. Really neat pop. We'll see if I can get it on his face a little bit just to show him off. He's cool. I love the I love Lost Boys. Great movie. Cult classic. We got the Frog Brothers. He was a hard one to acquire a little bit. Michael Emerson. We got Sam. Then we got the regular David. He was a Funko Shop, I think. Yeah, Funko Shop exclusive. Frog Brothers, and then he was Target. Actually, he was a t-shirt. I actually have a t-shirt that has him on it. But it's actually not the pop variant. It's just a regular uh, David. He's in Vampire, I think. Or no, maybe not. No, no, he's just regular, but it's cool. I like it. It just it has that classic look, but it was probably one of my favorite shirts. I used to wear it all the time. All right, we're going to work our way down. We'll flip it because we're getting into the bigger pops. All right, we got a little Stan Lee picture here. This is a Wish order. Wish is cool. I like Wish. It's neat. It's cheap. I mean, some of the stuff's terrible, but some of it's good. We'll go over here. We got another one. It's like a tribute picture to Stan Lee. And then we're going to Hedwig, Target exclusive. These are 10-inch pops, by the way. These are humongous. Uh, great one. Cool. Scrooge out of the gold. It's awesome. I got that. Ironically enough, it was kind of funny with that one. I ordered it, and I thought I was getting a small one. The box came, and I opened it, and I was, like, super confused because the price was only, like, 25 bucks, and there it was. Uh, Ursula, she, her Triton actually glows. Uh, I've, I've done it a few times. It's kind of hard to do because she's humongous, but that's cool. 10-inch SpongeBob. Neat pop. Really humongous. Crazy. Groot, the life-size Groot. He's a 10-inch, he's a they said, too, but this is before the boxes, if you see. They made the boxes smaller, less open area in there. Uh, there's the Groot. Then we got the Ragnarok Hulk from Target. He's a 10-inch pop as well. Move over here to Pikachu. I mean, it's just a big, humongous Pikachu. Yeah, awesome. Charmander. Another one there. They did good on the molds, though. They're really well done. The color's very vibrant. And then we got Thanos from Endgame. He's got his sword staff thing or what i think it was just like a sword like a double-edged sword in his hand it's cool and then we got stay puff 
Stay Puff, the big one. I have a couple six inch ones as well. But we're reaching 20 minute mark, so I think that's all I'm gonna do today. Uh, I'll shoot the other part of the video, like I said. Uh, my goal is to probably do it Friday, most likely. I'm gonna order like a tripod and a stand too, so this will be a little easier to do. Try to get that in. So when I'm pulling the camera around, it's not as hard. That's all I got for you. So y'all have a good afternoon, good evening, whatever. And we'll see you next time.